course, Seinfeld uh, was a world unto itself. You know, it really uh, impacted television, I think, a lot. And to this day, I get people, uh, wherever I go, I mean, New York, Los Angeles, I'm in Europe, for Christ's sake, I was in uh, Australia. Uncle Leo, Uncle Leo, they come, pour, so help me God. They walk down the street and they pour out of the goddamn stores and restaurants and things. Uncle Leo, grab me an autograph, you know, and then sign it and take a picture with me. I said, this is years afterwards. They don't know my name, unless it was just fine. But Uncle Leo, it's like a curse now. I swear, I can't believe it. I was at the Wailing Wall in Jerusalem. Is that the Western Wall? I don't know. And uh, I'd never been there before. It was a Sunday afternoon. And I was standing there just uh, kind of quite taken with what was going on with the wall. People going up to the wall, you know, and praying putting notes in the wall, you know, and, uh, and I was feeling very religious, I don't know what else to say, uh, very quiet, and all of a sudden I hear, Uncle Leo, where's the watch? It's one of the shows. It was like sacrilege at the wall, you know, you know. but everywhere I go, I still have fan mail, which I haven't answered this last batch, uh, for Uncle Leo. And I'm delighted. It's never happened before. You know, I'm thrilled. It's going to stop, but while it happens, you know, I, I love it.